Hey you guys, Linwood here and today I'm going to be showing you how to tie the stacked diamond knot. So stay tuned, thumbs up if you like it, and if you haven't seen my last video, you can do so by clicking the eye in the top right corner. Now in case you didn't realize, this entire video has been flipped for your viewing pleasure, so when I say right, it's also your right. When I say left, it's also your left. So let's just dive right in. Alrighty, so for all those wondering, uh, this tie was a gift from one of my, uh, he wasn't actually my student, but his name was Victor, he's a super kind kid, I absolutely love him, uh, and it's a Tommy Hilfiger tie, it's a contrast tie as well, so I absolutely love it, um, and yes, those are fish. So, yes. Um, so we're going to start off with our blade, which is a large end, by creating a power crease, which is basically going to happen just by placing your finger in the middle of the tie and pinching from the outside corners like so. From there, we're going to pull it to the center of the tie, right about where that button is. Okay? Then you're going to grab the tail, which is a thin end, cross it over the top of the blade, wrapping around the back, and up through the middle, like so. Once you've done so, you're just gonna go ahead and pass over to the left hand side, like this, wrapping around the back. So now we're back on the right, and we're going to come up and through the center from the front. So this is what we're currently looking at, okay? Just like so. Now from here, I'm going to actually take my tie and turn it outward, like that, and then pull it downward. So outward, downward, and wrap around. So let me show you that one more time because I know it's confusing. Outward, pull it downward, and then wrap it around the back. All right, once we've done that, I'm going to do the opposite. So I'm gonna just rotate it on this side. One full rotation, just like that. And then we're going to pull it up and through the center. So one more time, we'll go ahead and pull it over. Rotate it, so rotate one full rotation. So I should be seeing the seam here. I'm gonna pull it up and through the center like so. Okay? From here, it should look like a hot mess. All right? That's fine. <laughs> okay, so now I'm just going to go ahead and pull over, and I want to make sure my smooth side is the side exposed. So if you can see the seam, go back, redo a couple steps. It's not quite right. Okay? So from there, I'm going to go ahead and wrap around the back. So we're just going to go ahead and keep this baby flat right up against the body of the knot wrapping around the back like so and then we're going to come up and through the center from the front again all right so this is what it's currently looking at now once we're at this point we've got to have a place to tuck this tail so i'm going to go ahead and find this little pocket that we created here and we're just going to slide the tip of the tail directly through that pocket like so and from there, I'm going to adjust my tie by holding onto the blade and pushing up on the knot, like so. And now it's all about adjustment. So we're just gonna go ahead and bring this back portion out some like this and down. I want to kind of create that diamond type shape there. By the way, this name was suggested by my mom, of all people, which is so fitting because her birthday is August the 31st. And, um, you know, I'm just like, oh, so one more way for me to tell her happy birthday is by uh, taking her name suggestion, which she suggested it on Instagram. So if you ever wanted to suggest names for my knots, that's the place to do it at Who Sees This. So pull that collar on down once you've gotten it adjusted and there you have it, the diamond knot. Well, stacked diamond knot. So stay tuned for the next video. Thank you guys so much for watching as always. I hope that you liked this video. And if you did, please give it a thumbs up and share it with a friend who you know loves to be dapperly dressed. Take care, God bless. You're fancy now. Bye bye you guys.